Welcome back, everybody. Sports Now. It is a friendship that has spanned decades. Two well-known gentlemen, Tom Hedekin and Dave Dryden, two goalies, lifelong students of the game. Dryden, brother of Hall of Fame goaltender Ken Dryden, was in North Bay earlier in the week to make a guest appearance at a private goaltending lesson slash session at the Pete Palangio Arena. There is former National Hockey League goaltender Dave Dryden and goalie coach Tom Hedekin, a friendship that has lasted over 40 years. It began in the mid-70s at a Team Canada hockey school in British Columbia. Hedekin worked as a goalie assistant for a camp run by Dryden. Years later, in February 1979, Hedekin was a first-year goaltender at Guelph University, backstopping the Griffins. I was having a tough time. I was playing with, against older players. Our captain was 28. And so I wrote to Dave out of the blue, after not speaking with him for years, uh, I wrote to the Oilers, just Dave Dryden, Edmonton Oilers. And that night that he got the letter, he phoned me. What Dave said on the phone had a major impact on Tom. And he told me to read this book called Inner Tennis and replace the ball with a puck. It turned my season around. We won the, the OUA championship that year and the next year. Tom is such a student of the game, it was always neat to talk to him. And then we just kept in touch ever since. Decades later, just like the friendship began, a private goalie lesson at Pete Palangio earlier this week, two local goalies getting instruction from Tom and Dave. Decades have passed since Dryden's playing days. While many things have changed... It used to be stay on your feet. Well, now nobody stays, you know, on their feet. It used to be never make the first move. Well, now you have to. You have to predict where the puck is going to be going. One key aspect remains the same. Do whatever you need to do to keep the puck out of the net. Dryden points out a common thread amongst goaltenders that transcends time. The personalities of the people that become goaltenders are the same personalities as the guys back in the era when I was playing. There's a sense of responsibility to it all, and you know how important you are to the team, and you want to come up big for the team. Dryden's playing days ended as the 70s did, but time hasn't faded Tom's admiration for his skill. To me, he's the most brilliant goaltending mind in the world. Like, he has got so much analytical knowledge, and when he sees things in, in a goalie, or there are things that not many other people would see, including myself. It's probably, you know, 40 years since I've been on the ice with him, actually. And, uh, you know, he's just such a gentleman and such a class person. And he, they're, they're the people that I strive to be like as a coach and as a person. And Dave's been a big role model to me.